girls, it's Thursday. <laughs> I just finished applying for college. Today was like my most productive day ever. I handed in my transcript form. I finished my application. I proofread everything a zillion times. I had my friend read my essay and she liked it. Um, and I sent my SAT scores and I applied to nine colleges. So it's a good day. However, it's still going to be a quick video tonight because it's currently 11.19 p.m. and I still have to finish my Shakespeare homework. Laura, I thought your idea for the board game was really cute, but I don't know how it would really work. Like, would we move for each other in the board? Because then there'd be, like, fishing through items and, uh, yeah. If we could get a giant game of, like, words with friends going, except on, like, a grand scale, that would be awesome. Also, Laura, you could never never bore me. I could listen to you talk forever, as creepy as that sounds. So now I'm going to answer Laura's 2012 questions. One, what is your favorite thing you got for Christmas? I got tickets to see Darren Chris and how to succeed in business without really trying. And I also get to stay over in New York. Two, do you have any New Year's resolutions? Like Lisa Ann said, I don't really believe in resolutions. I like the idea of improving yourself, but I don't think it's realistic because every time I try to build up a resolution list, it's basically like become perfect, become this like alternate universe <laughs> version of yourself. If I had to pick like two, I would say study harder and stay in touch with people more. This is going to be really important in this year coming up because all of my friends are moving to different places and I really would hate to lose them. That goes for you guys too. And three! I would have to say my favorite song is Between Two for two completely different reasons. The first one is Vincent by Don McLean. I absolutely love his voice and I've never heard this song before. And also I'm a Vincent Van Gogh fangirl. So Lori really hit the nail on the head with this one. And the second one is Cold Coffee by Ed Sheeran. Am I saying that right? But it's only because I like how he says warning a lot. Oh yeah. Lisa Ann, you're the cutest thing I ever did see. I love seeing you play the violin and I'm really jealous of your TARDIS mug. I played the violin until fourth grade. The reason I quit, my bridge broke on stage and I walked off. Yep. Oh, so funny story. We're currently watching The Tempest in Shakespeare and it's the version with Helen Mirren and Russell Brand and Ben Wershashra, the guy from The Hour who plays Ariel. And the other day we were talking about why Ariel is naked in this adaption. And one of the kids in my class jokingly goes, Sex appeal! And my teacher laughed and was like, Um, I don't think so. Why? Girls, do any of you think he's sexy? Guess who was the only one who said yes. <laughs> and then I was talking to my teacher after and she was just like, And today in Shakespeare we learned that Aaron likes freakishly skinny men with fluffy hair. Sounds about right. I hope your first week of the new year is going splendidly, and I will talk to you soon. Bye! Why is my hand on my chin?